Hi, I'm Stefano Caposeco, Director of Product Marketing at Westinghouse Lighting. Let's talk about TLEDs. TLED lamps are LED lamps that are replacement lamps for linear fluorescent lamps. Common linear fluorescent lamps come in T5, T8, and T12. The T stands for tubular, and the T5 is actually the diameter. In this case, it will be 5 eighths of an inch. They're measuring in eighths of an inch. The T8 is tubular in 8 eighths of an inch, or 1 inch in diameter. And the T12 is 12 eighths of an inch, or 1 and a half inches in diameter. There's different types of TLED lamps. There's type A, that is direct install, also known as plug and play. There's type B, that is ballast bypass with internal drivers. There's type C, ballast bypass with external drivers. And there's type AB, that is a combination of type A and type B. So to further explain the different types, we have type A, which is direct install. It's the easiest way to replace the fluorescent bulb with a TLED. No electrician is required. And there's type B, which is a ballast bypass with an internal driver. Electrician is required to rewire the fixture. And remember, you need tombstone that are non-shunted. Then there's type C, which is also a ballast bypass with an external driver. The external driver is wired to the tombstones. Westinghouse does not offer this type. And finally, there's type AB, which is a combination of type A and type B. And there's limited availability, and Westinghouse does not offer this type. This is a fluorescent fixture in the industry known as a wrap. We're going to take it apart and describe the different components. The reason why this is called a wrap is because the lens wraps around the fixture. This is the cover, and it just snaps off, which exposes the guts of the fixture. You have the ballast, the wires, and the sockets, also known as tombstones, and this is the chassis. Every fluorescent fixture has a ballast that converts the incoming voltage, 120 volt, with 277 volts to the proper power necessary for the bulb. The tombstone sockets are is what actually provides power to the light bulb itself, either fluorescent or TLED. In addition to holding the bulb, they provide the power to the bulb, either fluorescent or TLED. For type B installation, it's important to check for continuity to determine whether you have shunted or non-shunted. Best way of doing this is with a voltmeter and, and you're checking for continuity. In this case, these tombstones are shunted, meaning there's continuity, and we cannot use them in a ballast bypass type B installation. We need non-shunted lamp holders in this case, we're showing different models. The easiest way to enjoy all the benefits of a LED bulb to replace a fluorescent is to use direct install bulbs. First thing we want to do is cut the power off to the fixture. Next, we want to remove the fluorescent bulbs. and install the direct install bulbs. Make sure you use to place the heat sink label that it's not visible. Then we turn the power on and it's done. To convert a fluorescent fixture into a ballast bypass fixture, it's more complicated and electrical contractor is needed to do this work. What the electrician would do is cut the wires to the ballast and take the incoming power, 120 volts or 277 volts, directly into the tombstone. 
please remember that to make sure that all the tombstones in the fixture are non shunted. The incoming power will go directly into the non shunted tombstone, jump to the other set of tombstones, and the other end, they would not be powered, they would just be used to hold the lamps in place. One last important part of the retrofit is to make sure to install this label where it's visible during relamping to make sure that you let the installer know that anytime you replace the bulbs, you can no longer use fluorescent bulbs in this fixture. The ballast is gone completely. You can only replace using ballast bypass bulbs. I hope this information was helpful. For more information, visit our website, westinghouselighting.com, to learn more about our full line of LEDs. Thank you.